hello there. Let me get to your introduction. So, in case the uh, cyclop wasn't that good, let's use this intro. Here I am, let's swing over there and have a look at the river. Oh. Yeah. Well, hello there, uh, friends and followers. I just wanted to give a quick intro before I run Jen's video. First off, a big shout out to the more than 500 subscribers now following this little channel. I think that's pretty cool. It wasn't long ago that uh, I only had 50, and of those 50, I think I only knew about 10 of them. Anyway, like everyone else, I'm uh, currently unable to travel, still in Canada, unable to get back to Thailand, waiting for their airports to reopen, of course, to foreigners. Um, I can report, though, that Jen and Yubi are healthy and doing well. Jen's uh, recently had the grand opening for her second bakery location. That's what this video that I throw in is going to be about. It's uh, more designed for the walk-in customers, uh, the pre-orders and pickups. It is located right across the street from the hospital, the main entrance in Buriram. So anyone needs a quick snack before going in or coming out or whatever, uh, it's there. So, whew. it's hot. Yeah, so I hope you enjoy this video and uh, I'm out cycling. <laughs> Gotta get the shirt. Um, and uh, running and jogging, I've done it all since uh, I've been in lockdown. So, anyways, hope you enjoy this video and uh, thanks for coming along. It starts with an idea, realizing its need, it becomes real by design. It's also great having friends that can weld cubes. Here is the construction of Jen's point of sale cube and unofficially named by my friend Don as the Sugar Shack. And that's kind of funny because very few items actually contain any sugar at all. It will end up becoming a 3 by 3 by 3 meter air-conditioned semi-portable cube. As you can see it's built completely off-site and then it will be dropped into place when it's ready. Moving day is always exciting. Of course, this time is a little different because the big question is will it fit? Not knowing if they use the measure twice cut once rule in Thailand. So first we'll get it off of the truck, bring it down the sidewalk, and then put it back into place. A little bit of dragging and encouragement is always useful. The interior was designed and fabricated completely off-site and then installed later after the cube had landed. Coolers, refrigerators and cash register were also added after touchdown. The cube itself incorporates the same roll-down security door as we have on our home, the, uh, the tie pad. We use it at home on the car and the scooter entrances.
would be complete without the monk's blessing, and then finally the grand opening. So like I've mentioned before, it is located right in the heart of Buriram, right across from the main entrance to the hospital. If you like, you can leave me a comment below and let me know you're coming. That way, we can have a special treat waiting for you. Oh, <clears throat> one sec, I need some water. <clears throat>